So I, Doris, swear that I should be a friend to my fellow Dorises, even at social distance. I, I Doris. Doris. I shall wear a mask on the bus and give up my seat to a Doris who needs it more than I do. I no. Doris. I'm not gonna go, belly just make it shake like jello, lol, mind your business. Because like, people are constantly also asking me if I'm pregnant, which is like uncomfortable for me. It's uncomfortable for them when I'm like, I'm not. Uh, so I wish people would stop asking that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, I mean, my my youngest gal. child is seven now, and and people still stand up for me on the on the bus. And I know I'm happy to have a seat. Quite frankly, uh, <laughs> right. it, but it's just like, come on, unless someone's water is literally breaking on your like feet, like just don't ask that question. And it's weird, it, also, but, oh, it always used to make me paranoid about drinking as well. Yeah, because I'd be outside the pub with a fag and a beer, and I'd be like, "People are judging me because they assume I'm pregnant." <laughs> oh my I would gosh! Not do this if I was pregnant. <laughs> that <laughs> totally yeah. happened to me at a wedding. Like I was at my friend's wedding. It was like a really awesome wedding, open bar. Like you know, it's like a mix of like Southern and Korean food. It was like a mix of both of her mm. cultures. And I went up to the bar and I was like, "Can I get a gin and tonic?" And the guy was like, "I don't serve pregnant chicks." <gasps> and that completely just like ruined my night. <laughs> oh, like, my yes. oh, oh my god! Oh my gosh! Like so many levels to this.